Yep. Okay, so, so here is the elevator at the Cityplex. This is a bonus video. Uh, the Cityplex main tower, 60 stories. And this is in Tulsa, Oklahoma. Yep, there's the... Yeah, yeah, don't hit my arm, please. Yeah, it does have fire service. They have to have that on these high-rise elevators. That way smells good. Yep, here's the elevator right here. Back out of the way. All right, we'll go up to 59. Uh, what floors are you going to? So, uh, I'm going to 41. 41. Let me oh, it's locked. Can you do 42? Yeah. 42 so also, right okay. Go up there. The indicator. You are. Look at that store. Oh, it skips the same service elevator. Oh, congratulations. Here's the fixtures. Love it. This one's an express elevator, so it does not have 60 buttons on it. Oh, they're like, I don't know where Close the door. I have a feeling I might have just closed it on somebody. Press the call button. And we'll go up to 59. It says relay controlled elevators. These are old switches. They are. It's some of the oldest over traditional ever made. 60s locks. Does this have classic leveling? Uh, no, it's Dover. Dover doesn't come with that. Yep, so here we are on 59 again. This is my second video up here. There's a better window, we can see the RV over here. Hopefully, uh, other way. This one. Hopefully I'm not shaking too much. Look at how low the ceilings are though. That's one reason you could tell this building's really old. There might be some wind noise. They have nice air conditioners. Oh, wow. your they got some uh, a bird. stuff. Oh, look at that bird. There's a bird. Mm -hmm. Oh man. He's really high up. What are you in? Oh Those? shoot, there's one of the wasps. Oh uh, yeah. Yep, That's there's the uh but we'll look at the RV once, you know, just down there, the big long vehicle there on This is scary. Right there's the RV. Why is it scary? Mm -hmm. Yep, there's the building. Bird is creepy. The bird's been up there actually for quite a while. Uh huh. Oh, here's a map. Here's a map. There's a map there. And there's our elevator. Decided to wait for us. I was hoping to get a service elevator again. Anyways, we're going to get the cab view since this thing's decided to stay here and not move. I missed the cab view on the other one. Pretty nice cab. There's Dad, Ian, me, and the mirror. Hi. And there's Ryan. Yep, pretty basic cab interior, I think. Anyways, just push one now. We'll go back down. Wow, quite fast. Doesn't light up on that side? Well, that's unfortunate. Anyways, since we're in the express zone, I'll take a look at all these buttons. I'd really like to go get the service elevator, because that one's got a lot more buttons. <laughs> so Dover. Here. Yep, Dover. It's right up there. Dover. Typical 3,500 pound capacity. Is it stopping at five? Or no, it's stopping at one. It's going down. See? Oh, okay. That's it's that express indicator. It I can have. see outside. Don't do that. Mm -hmm. If you trip the interlock, it will. Oh, you weren't pulling on it? Okay, yeah, don't pull on the doors. Otherwise, it'll trip an interlock. That one serves all 60 floors. This one? Yep. 
Is this a freight this, elevator? Yep, this is a freight elevator. If you take a look in here, I'm just going to get a look at the fixtures. Okay, come on inside. Take a look at all those buttons. Can I go take a ride up quick? Okay, I'll wait down here. Okay. Go up to 59. Bye, guys. Okay, we're going to go up to 59. We'll get a somewhat close up of the indicator counting all the way up to 59. Here are the relay. Good try to get an express trip on the way down, hopefully. It's kind of hard, it's actually really high up. It skips 39 on the indicator for some reason on this elevator. I don't know why, but it does. I don't know if I'm shaking, but it might be. You know, it's gonna have a rough stop right up on 59. Here we are in 59, hopefully no one will be getting on. Good, you know, if anybody else getting on. Close the door then. I'm going to get the cab to you on this one. Thankfully, I didn't pause the video halfway through this time. It's part of the reason why I'm making this bonus video. I convinced my dad to come up here with me. It's quite a big cab. Look at all those buttons there. There's a lot of buttons. This used to be the hospital freight elevator. You can tell because it's just the width for a bed and also just long enough. It's a card reader. Seriously, I'm really amazed by the number of buttons on there. There's the indicator. Anyway, we'll get a look up at these buttons going real slow so we can see all of them. Look at that. I might speed it up just a little bit. Otherwise, this might take a little while. Pretty amazing. Unfortunately, 60 is locked. I really wish it wasn't, but it is. Can't do anything against that. Oh well. We'll go all the way down now. All the way back to one. Not gonna get as close to the indicator this time. The usual just skips 39 for some reason. I think it might be a relay error or something. This elevator's got a capacity of 4,500 pounds. Not sure the speed, but Still, I really like these things. This is the building with the most floors that I've been in. That's not a observation tower. And the tallest building I've been in that's not an observation tower is actually taller than this, Republic Plaza. It has 56 floors. But this has 59, or 60, it's actually shorter than Republic. Well, that's just going to stay there, so that's it.